Another idea uh, that people talk about, they call it brain reserve. Years ago, we thought that you had a certain amount of neurons by the time you were an adult, let's say age 20, you had a certain amount of brain cells, synapses, and all you could do was lose them. You couldn't gain them. And so brain reserve was you just had more of them to start with. Over the last 15 years or so, we've discovered that the brain is much more plastic or changeable than we ever imagined. We used to think that you had a certain amount of brain cells, a certain amount of connections, and all you could do was lose them. And now we're realizing that the brain really maintains itself and changes itself with experience. It turns out that people who um, exercise more actually seem to do better in epidemiologic studies. And now in controlled studies, where you take people who really don't exercise, elders or even young people, uh, and you just have them do um, aerobic exercise, walking, jogging, just uh, uh, three hours, three times a week, actually improves their cognition. Aerobic exercise, besides increasing neurogenesis, uh, increases certain chemicals in the brain that are very important for helping the synapses, the connections between neurons, develop. They call it plasticity. So, so and, and people who exercise, the actual size of the brain changes. So you can show that after people exercise a lot, some areas in their frontal lobes, which are very important for cognition, actually get larger.